Good morning. I'm looking um, a little too like made up and fresh right now. More so than I usually am. It's like the first time I've put on makeup and showered and moussed. Yes, I still use mousse and all that kind of stuff in days. I got home from vacation two days ago and it's Wednesday, so I figured I would do like a wax Wednesday, but I can't really do a what I'm warming or what I've been warming Wednesday because I was on vacation and we couldn't bring a warmer to on a cruise ship. You're not allowed to have a warmer on a cruise ship because God forbid, you know, a wave comes and there goes the wax and all that. So I'm going to be telling you what I've been whiffing uh, with Wednesday, <laughs> what I've been huffing. Um... Okay, so while I was away, I did bring my go with me and I did put jammy time, fresh jammy time pods in here. This thing is amazing. We had a pretty large room on the cruise ship and um, it scented the entire room. I brought it with me pretty much everywhere I went. Um, we did take a couple of excursions and there was one time that the bus was like stank, like total stank wasn't the cruise company's fault. It wasn't the excursion company's fault. People stink. You know what I mean? You're walking around Rome for seven hours. Things stink. So I was really glad that I had this with me. This thing weighs nothing. By the way, if you don't know what a Sensi Go is, this, uh, you power this with a uh, USB and it's rechargeable and it'll go for like 44 hours. Yeah. <laughs> like a really long time. And there's a little fan in the bottom. So when you turn it on, um, it blows air up through these pods and um, it makes an amazing scent. And if you wanted to, it's also good in an emergency because it's also a light and you could change the color of the light. Anyway, I love this thing. This is the original that I got a year ago at Scentsy Convention. They gave us all one for free because when you go to Scentsy Convention, they give you lots of goodies. Um, I still have my original, still works like a champ. So uh, anyway, these have, you know, a, a limited warranty. So even if anything goes bad, you just call up Scentsy and they'll either try to fix it for you or they'll, they'll replace it for you. So anyway, I brought that with me. So I was smelling jammy time because those were the pods that I brought. I did bring an extra pack of Luna pods, but I never needed them. So I had a feeling that I was going to need them. This is another thing that's not wax. So I went to Italy and I went to Sorrento. Yes, I'm a Scentsy consultant, but I'm also allowed to buy perfume. Hi. Um, one of the reasons why I chose this perfume is because my husband and I both like it and we could both use it. It's very cologne-like. If you are familiar with Scentsy products, this is similar to like Mystery Man or the Lapis Lazuli or um, the Green Calce. It's very fresh. In fact, I'm, gonna, I'm on my way to a uh, parent association meeting at my kid's school and I gotta go soon. So I, I put everywhere. I put it everywhere. So anyway, unfortunately, this is called um, Encanto, Encanto di Sorrento, okay? It's a beautiful um, scent, but it does not stick around on me. Most people understand that, um, you know, your perfume has a lot to do with, or the effectiveness of your perfume has a lot to do with your body chemistry. So this smells really good when I first put it on, but it kind of goes away in the next, in the next 20, 30 minutes. I'm not going to be able to smell anything. It's possible that other people will smell it on me, but I won't smell it. And I feel like that's even just as important, if not more important, because I like to smell myself. Yeah, that sounds gross. But anyway, Encanto di Sorrento. Love it. It was only, only like 16, 17 bucks. So I could probably do a search for it on the internet and find it. Okay. Everybody who earned the incentive trip for a Sensi, you know, had the opportunity to go on a cruise. And they also gave us a bar of Provence lavender wax. Everybody was pooping themselves when they found this in their room because what happens is you go on these trips and every day you come back from your excursions or come back from the pool or something like that around five or six o'clock and then all of a sudden there's a gift in your room. It's kind of crazy. So I only warmed three cubes of this in my living room because I'm being a little bit sparing. Um, everybody got one bar and it smells so amazing. It's so strong like lavender. Now I am, obviously, it's strong like lavender. So 
I am a huge lavender fan. Some people are not. Um, as a practicing massage therapist, I used to go through gallons of lavender. Lavender is one of those universal spa scents. It's very therapeutic. Uh, it has a very herbal scent, depending on the kind of lavender you get. This is very herbal. You can almost make a tea out of it. You can't, obviously, but... It is so fabulous. I put the three cubes in my living room, and I just... I felt like... Felt like I was still on vacation a little bit. Couldn't wait to get home to warm this. Okay. And it came in the bag with the little, you know, burlap tie and everything. It was very nice. Very nice presentation. Okay. Um, I had to, I, I, I ran out. So in order to give you a good description, I wanted to be able to smell it. So I took the dish off of the warmer in my room. When I got home, I wanted to make sure that I was warming something in my bedroom that was very comforting to me because I was afraid we were going to have a little jet lag and I wanted to be able to sleep really well. This is the Amethyst from the Crystal Collection that was released last month. This is an intoxicating scent. I love it. It's got lavender. It's got like, I think a little bit of um, jasmine, I think. I don't remember what the notes are. It doesn't matter. You need this. You need this in your life. It's not this lavender. It's a different, this is more of a floral lavender. I think it's got a little vanilla. It's just so fabulous. I absolutely love it. I mixed two cubes of that with a cube of pink haze. Now, everybody knows that I switch it to these when it gets them. These two together were fabulous. You could order both of these. They're both available. So this is sort of like a Metallica Mom mixology also. These two were great. Try Amethyst mixed with pink haze. Fabulous. And in my bathroom, I put pina colada cha-cha, which is now down to this much. This is a perfect bathroom scent for me because it's very, um, I'm not huge into coconut, but coconut can like cover things up. You know what I mean? And the fact that there's pineapple in here too, because it's a pina colada. Um, it also reminded me of my vacation because everybody was drinking pina coladas. I don't drink pina coladas. I think my husband drank one. Anyway, this was very nice in my bedroom. That's the uh, bathroom. That's where I like to warm this one. So that's what I've been warming. I've got to go because my meeting starts in 23 minutes and I got to walk there. So um, that's my what I've been whiffing Wednesday. Next week, it'll probably all be wax. Uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe and hit the um, you know, little notification thing there. And if you like hearing about stuff other than wax, let me know because I don't fragrance my home with anything other than Scentsy, but I do fragrance my life with other things that Scentsy does not provide. Um, you know, if you want to know more about that, I can talk to you about scenting my litter box. I can talk to you about if I run out of washer whiffs, which I did yesterday. I'm getting a, a shipment in tomorrow, but I do laundry every day because I have boys in the house. So anyway, if you want to know about other stuff other than Scentsy, let me know and I can go ahead and, and start to incorporate those on my What I'm Whiffing Wednesday. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.